Good morning! You can't really see me, but I was trying to show you guys my view outside. Yeah, I've been away for a little bit, and um, I am, I've been downstairs actually, preparing breakfast and stuff. So the girls have been awake. My youngest just finally woke up, and they're tending to their pets. They're feeding their pets a little bit. Check out my breakfast. I'm sweating out some stuff on my counter, such as these sweet peas and stuff, because uh, we went to the grocery store and we bought the wrong ones. These ones say they don't have any preservatives, but because I'm watching my sodium intake, I haven't mentioned that to you guys at all, but if I have mentioned it on my beauty channel, on Beauty by Chick, I have been, I was suffering from uh, high blood pressure at one point so then I was on blood pressure medication and I didn't like the way it was making me feel so I asked my doctor to come off of it after a while and I've been doing really well eating um, the right things on my own so and with that said I've also lost like 15 pounds from it so if you guys want to know more about that stuff I can blog a little bit more about I, I don't know me doing my workout and stuff like that but I bought the wrong uh, peas because the vegetables that I now buy, they have, they're like health choice and they only have 10 milligrams of sodium as opposed to 370. Like we're, yeah, like 370 milligrams of sodium. It's um, like, I, I know that this is per, this is only for half a cup. So in reality, there is like, holy mackerel, there's like 520, 40 milligrams of sodium in this. This is crazy. Anyways, this is my breakfast, if you can see. I just made it. It's an instant pack of oatmeal. And it... I just cut up bananas and... And uh, added nuts to them. A lot of cleaning to be done around this house. And... The fact that no one has an activity today is great. So I told the kids that I think we're going to go out for a quick morning walk before we proceed with our work and I don't know their friends might come over this evening so you might get to see a little bit of that so this is the oatmeal that I'm eating it's wheat free and um, it's a variety pack so this is the first time that I bought this one but if you can see like that is pretty good for sodium it only has 110 milligrams of sodium uh, the one I ate today was this one the banana maple nut and with flax and it only has 110 milligrams of sodium is that so yeah so one quarter equals how many nickels so one Five. very oh you knew the answer mm -hmm. did you know the answer before no I thought it was four Okay, no, one, it's five, just like you said. But how did you get there? Let's mm -hmm. count. It is five, but let's let's figure it out. Okay, so this is a quarter, and a quarter is... What's another way of saying quarter? Look at it and tell me, how many cents is a quarter? 25 cents. Very good. Okay. You need to go to the washroom? Yeah. Every time we start something important, she needs to go to the bathroom. <laughs> so, um, we're currently on the floor. We decided to come over here to, I guess, spread the money out on the floor because it's an easy way to teach her how to deal with money. And the problems that she's doing in her book are money-based at the current moment. So, uh, I'm going to get up and show you guys the view from outside. It's very beautiful out there. See if I can give you guys a view from here. That's it. The clouds are looking kind of funny, but I don't think it's supposed to rain. And if you can see far over there, there are some geese laying. She was saying she washed her grapes with soap. And I've done that. I've washed my apples with soap before. <laughs> but I don't know if it's if it's a weird thing, but it's true, like these fruits are so dirty. We have, you guys have afternoon work to do, you haven't completed your English yet, right? Me? Yeah, you. Last spring. 
No, you didn't. That sign smart is not English. Isn't that cool? Look! I should have done that in front of you. Mm-hmm. Who loves tomatoes? Me. Me. I know this one here doesn't like tomatoes. <laughs> How about you try it? Can you try this one? This is actually different than regular tomatoes. And we can cherry tomatoes. Go ahead and try it, yeah. Oh, I think you'll actually really like it. Me too. Come on, hurry up. How's the taste? Be honest. It does, doesn't it actually taste good? It does. I mean, you like it. Tomato juice. Mm hmm. That's really good tomatoes. Do you like one? Mm, thank you. Yes, please. I have a little time on my hands. I'm going to do it right now. Um, I'm also arranging a couple of unit things that my children will be doing. So I'm trying to make a decision here. My eldest is going to be doing, she's in grade 5, so she's going to be doing um, this. It's a literature kit, really, that's what it says. And she reads through the books and has the study guide to go along for each chapter, so she'll be doing that. And I'm trying to make a decision here. My photocopier is broken down because if it, I could actually just use this for the younger girls at home, which I still think I'm going to do, perhaps I'm just going to have to go run and pick another copy of that up. I have Island of the Blue Dolphin, which I was going to use for the younger ones, but looking at it now I realize that it's probably a little too advanced. Maybe my, my eight-year-old will be able to do this one. And the girls are gone to, um, the girls are gone to, to get the other books upstairs. I'm going to show you guys a clip of our current of our current situation. I'm going to interject it right here so you guys can see um, this library setup that we're trying to achieve. So this is the hubby packing away at the library, getting it sorted out. Honestly, <laughs> these socks are so random. <laughs> yeah. I think they're like garbage, are they not? No, no. They have lunch. And we're probably going to put some in here. Oh, we already did. Yeah. yeah. And once it's set up, I guess we'll work on the walls. We'll do something with the wall. Yep. Paint. That's paint. <laughs> Isn't that funny? We're actually setting up the stuff now, and we're going to paint the walls after. Uh, What's your thought? No, that's easy. Because actually, it's not a very complicated room. You just pull things off the wall. I know, but it's books. Like, what if they go falling off the bookshelf? Uh, it's a carpet. It's not, it's not that hard. You can just slide it. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm not going to argue. <laughs> hey, you're a sweet. Mm -hmm. Sweet, sweet. And I think I'm going to have to either cut those curtains or buy know. something else. What do you want to do with this? I'll probably donate that. It's okay. Okay, I have a couple books over here that, like... I see a couple right down there by the socks. Yeah, those are all things that I put aside. <laughs> I'm contemplating if I should donate this picture. I don't... <gasps> I'm always thrown off by something. You guys take a guess. Well, I mean... It's a pretty can you advertise this manga messiah. Uh hold on. <laughs> it's manga. a it's a manga New Testament. That's pretty cool. That's that's cool. Our kids have actually learned a lot from it. So that's Bella's eating the cucumber. Yeah. Bella's eating the apple. I Wanna introduce everyone to these little creatures? This, this is Angel. Angel. Mm hmm She looks like a mom. Angel is a this one is year old and it's okay, you don't have to pick her up. And this is Velma. We've had her for over four years. And then there is who is this? Peanut. This is Peanut. She's relatively new. And 
Oreos. Oreos are like a baby cake. So Peanut and Oreo are, I think, are siblings because we got them from the same pet shop. And they are how old now? When did we get them? The 27th of August. Yeah. We got one the 27th and one the 20th. We got them a few. Look whose tooth just came out. Yay! Oh yeah, <laughs> go rinse it out. It finally came out. Yeah. Go rinse it out. She's been waiting forever for that tooth to pop out and it was just in the weirdest place. So we're currently in search of Gabrielle's tooth because it came out. It just <laughs> it flew out and kind of just flew. You have to be careful. Her tooth came out of her mouth while she's watching the show and just kind of like flew behind the sofa, she believes. There you go. <laughs> okay, come on. Let's get our living room back together. This is a CD that the, my hubby and I are currently listening to. Well, he started listening to it in the vehicle. And um, he, he listens to it on his way to work. I haven't listened to it yet, but he's uploading it on our computer so we can listen to it as a family. And he's also trying to incorporate the kids into it, listening to it because it's obviously beneficial to everyone. And teaching them to be effective, highly effective at an early age is really good. So I hope we can get that uploaded soon. Um, these kids are on like snack number, I don't know. Oh my gosh. I know. <laughs> Just don't pick your nose. I'm <laughs> joking. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Who is it? Oscar? Mr. Oscar. He's coming. He's excited, huh? He is like standing there looking at me. Am I allowed to come up the stairs? Oh. <laughs> See, he delayed coming in. <laughs> Say hi to the camera, Oscar. Say hi. He's a good boy. He doesn't even know where to look. See, looks like these were good for early reading. Look at my child. Look what she keeps. She likes to keep junk and make stuff out of it. Look at this. This is garbage. I know. Oh. I know. You came home? Here. Yeah, I did. I saw. I know. It's so cute. Though. Isn't it cute? Really cute. I, I saw that. That's so cute. That is so cute. There, those girls are so they're great, huh? But you would never make this yourself. I just got smart enough. <laughs> is that that's the good that's the good answer, right? Hmm? No, seriously. It's so simple. It's plain yogurt. I know. With walnuts. I know. Probably took you like two seconds. So what's so complicated as to why you wouldn't make it yourself if you think it tastes good? This is so cute, but we gotta put other pictures in there because it looks bad. It's, it's, exact, same, it's the exact same picture. Okay, so here's the thing. I need a lid for that. I need to put away these socks. Things like this are all together. Okay, this bin, these these things have to get sorted. That's mm -hmm. the biggest mess, okay? These, these little things have to get sorted. Mm -hmm. We need a proper, we need a proper junk? No, we need a proper container for this. Can you try? Uh, yeah, then I'll, bring the, I'll go get the lid. Are you not going to get the lid out of there? Well, I'm not going to get because if it's going back downstairs, the lid's down there. Oh, I wanted to put up the map. So I'm testing out the lighting because this is where I'm planning on doing my makeup for my um my beauty channel. I don't want to do it this time of the day because it looks kind of bright. I guess I'll see. I could always close the curtain a little bit, right? Mhm. Mm yep. Control the amount of light that's let in. Like with this, yeah, that's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Yay! I brought a bunch of books that I um, dropped off at Talese yesterday. It's just that they have so many Bibles. I don't know. I think you should go to sleep. 